Today, in the new frontiers of deep and ultra-deep water production, flow assurance planning begins early and collaboration is critical between operators and chemical suppliers to ensure success for these high-risk, heavy investment subsea projects. Deep water developments are, by their very nature, located in remote locations and involve environmentally challenging and potentially hazardous working conditions. For operators, it is very important that the production chemicals you use are qualified and reliable so your subsea assets, your personnel, the environment, the facility and your financial investment are protected against the risk associated with umbilical plugging or failures. In a typical deep water production project, subsea wellheads are clustered together and connected or tied back to a platform or host floating production storage and offloading vessel or FPSO through flow lines and a manifold. Most of these wells and their associated flow lines will have flow assurance challenges, whether related to scale, asphaltines, paraffin, gas hydrates, corrosion, or a combination of them. Production chemicals often offer a cost-effective method of mitigation for these challenges that help prevent unnecessary production losses, remediation costs, and undesirable environmental impacts due to restrictions, blockages, and corrosion failures. The chemical treatment is typically delivered from the FPSO or platform through a tube in the umbilical bundle. The umbilical links the host facility to the producing wells via a subsea umbilical termination assembly or SUTA. Jumpers then carry the chemicals to the individual wellheads or to injection systems that carry the chemicals to various points within the wellbore. The chemicals must reach the injection point and reliably perform as expected to keep production flowing. If the chemicals are unstable, poorly designed, or contain particulate matter, there is a greater risk they will block the umbilical tube carrying them. Umbilical failures in a subsea project can lead to complex operational risks, repair downtime, expensive replacement costs, and loss of production. There are long lead times when a new umbilical is required, typically at a cost of $1 million per kilometer. Tiebacks can be over 20 miles long. Whatever the cause of the umbilical failure, if the chemical treatments do not reach their targets in time, production flow is negatively affected. Today, operators can depend on the new Baker Hughes Fathom Subsea Certified Chemicals to help them produce reliably, safely, and effectively in deep water production. Our Fathom Subsea Chemicals undergo stringent testing and must meet exacting standards for reliability deliverability and performance, compatibility with materials of construction, low temperature and high pressure stability, as well as high temperature and high pressure stability. Baker U certifies all Fathom subsea chemicals through a process involving 16 different laboratory tests. Our 16 test methods are built upon the standards recommended by the Joint Industry Project, basics, blockage avoidance and subsea injection and control systems and published in API specification 17TR6 to ensure each chemical product is qualified for reliable subsea application. Baker Hughes professionals undergo a rigorous competency assessment prior to working offshore. Each member is trained to apply Fathom certified chemicals properly and to recognize incompatibilities and other potential problems. The rigorous qualification process employed by Baker Hughes for certifying Fathom subsea chemicals means that you can rely on our subsea products to deliver reliable, trouble-free performance for mitigating flow assurance and asset integrity challenges in virtually any deep water or ultra deep water production environment. For more information about Fathom subsea certified chemicals, contact Baker Hughes, www.bakerhughes.com forward slash Fathom.